Hey guys, welcome back to Paper Mario. Last time we left off here at Red Station. And really all that's left to do in here is beat General Guy, the boss of Chapter 4. So let's get on with it and do it. So this time we'll probably include the Princess Peach stuff rather than starting off a new episode with that. I guess I could have tied this on at the end of last episode, but I was nervous about the time. So let's go. Boom. That's satisfying, just blowing open a wall of toys. <laughs> No screaming, shy guys, get out of here. Look at that shooting star, that does six damage to all enemies. That's way better than an egg missile. It's better than Thunder Rage, even. Don't worry, this song will be ending soon, if it's getting annoying. But I like it, it's just crazy. I see a hidden block. What's up here? This seems like, uh... Oh, that's so you can knock that down with Cooper, I get it. It all makes sense now. Except I don't have inventory space for that, I know that much. Yeah, I may have like one spot- No, we've tested this last time! I tried to get the Super Shroom. Duh, how soon we forget! What is this? A sleepy sheep. Yeah, I don't have room for it. Get out of here, sheep. Nobody's got time for you. Alright, let's do it, finally! Oh wait, is it not yet? Oh yeah, that's right, we've gotta run through this dark room. Run for it! Jeez, would you shut up? You're almost worse than the Gerudos in Majora's Mask. Boom, 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 boom. Alright, it's done. It's time. So you came, did you? I'm General Guy. We're following the orders of King Bowser regarding the Star Spirit. As long as we keep it secure, we have permission to do whatever we want. You hear? I don't care for you, sir. You are rude, and furthermore, you're trespassing in here. Our toy box is off limits to the likes of you. The treasures inside this box are for shy guys only. And that Star Spirit's fate is none of your business. Prepare to fight me, sir. Taste the fate! Charge! <laughs> Screaming shy guys. Let's do it. So what is who you're going to want primarily? All together now. Charge. Because Watt can penetrate any kind of defense with the Electro Dash. Power Shock paralyzes an enemy, and Turbo Charge boosts Mario's attack for a time. Bum ba dum dum Awesome music again. Shy Squad. Hold A! And there you go. I guess we'll just give him a whack. See what happens. Oh yeah! I wonder if this is gonna one-shot him. Thank you. Are you still alive or are you broken? Still alive! Ten, man! Wow, that's awesome! Oh, and one lives. Well, not anymore. Zap tap, baby. Mercy, he beat them all up! That surely isn't good! Guess it's up to me! <laughs> I like this. Mario, you, sir, will pay! You beat my infantry, but that's all you'll do! Prepare for the next wave! This music is so good! I love it when the music like goes in time with the action on screen. Shy guys on stilts. Yoshi's Island much? Uh, much too much. All right, how do we want to do this? We could power jump on them one at a time. We could star spirit, or we could. I do have that egg missile. Let's do a thunder rage. Attack everybody. Oh, I miss refund already. Just that animation of getting money back. And it, I, I guess you can't attack General Guy right now? I forgot about this. It's been a long time since I fought this guy, and I haven't watched any kind of videos of other people doing it, so... I'm just winging it. Oh, wow. Even blocked that was two damage. And those are your big numbers when you're talking Mario. Well, Mario RPG had big numbers. Stilt Guy, you're going down. Alright, now is it time for General Dude? Unbelievable! I guess it's time for my special battalion! There's more? Oh yeah, they stack up on each other. Uh-oh. I have a wasted turn now as well. Unless it starts over. I don't remember what happens here. I pity you, sir! It's time you paid, Mario! Attack! Yes, sir! Oh, looks like we're starting a fresh turn. Alright. Well, I guess we'll do one stack at a time. We've got food from Tasty, if we need the FP restoration. This is the best part of the music. You're done. I don't know how much damage they do. Whoa! I was not expecting that, but that makes sense. Well played, sir. 
But I'm afraid the fun ends here. Well, how? Well, now, General Guy and his light bulb. I remember that light bulb can do something crazy, but I don't remember what's up with it. It's been a while. Yeah, fine, I'll beat you myself. Nobody embarrasses the brave shy guys of my army. Nobody. All right. Hmm. Let's see, this is an example. We can attack the bulb or general guy, but he's hiding in there. So Mario is kind of useless. But if you bring in Watt... Shock right through his little tank. Ah, my high-tech tank defenses don't seem to stand up against that electric attack. Quit doing that. It's too powerful. You're breaking the rules of war. <laughs> Yeah, see? Penetrate all the defenses. Wah is who you want. As is expected. I wonder, what if I throw this egg missile at his bulb? Boom! It didn't break, though. Uh-oh! I timed it! Oh, I think I had to time it for Watt. But see, that's another thing. That was an electric attack. It did nothing to Watt. That's amazing! Oh, I forgot all about this stuff. It's good. Let's see if we can pop this thing once and for all. Yep, there goes Shattered. No more of that nonsense. All right, Watt, do your thing. What is that? Oh, I didn't time it right. Oh, no, I'm in peril. Uh, do we roll with it? No. We're not, we haven't even really scratched the surface here. A fried egg? That's an option. Uh, see, the problem is I'm almost at full FP, so... See, that's the one drawback of cooking, though. As I kind of touched on before, but that fried egg has been chilling in there for a while and it may taste it good. What she got? Alright, let's get it. Dang it, man, I can't time that. I don't know when you have to press A. Like when it's right on Mario's face. Have a thunderbolt, pal. Oh, I wish I still had refund active. I really should. I'm not even using the power plus benefits in this particular battle here. Are you done? No, you're still going. All right, we got this this time. Boom, there we go, two. Uh, we're in danger. Do we roll with it? Have another Thunderbolt. I want to clean out my inventory. I think that's really the best move I have, because Mario's attacks wouldn't do five damage. He's done, yes! How's the taste? That's a fun fight, I like it. And we leveled up. All right. What do we want to do? Badge points again? Let's climb our way. I think 30 is where you max out in this game. Run, little buddies. I still want a Shy Guy RPG, though. You can make a spin-off of any character in the Mario series, honestly. Yeah, yippee! We beat the Shy Guys! <laughs> you weren't so tough, you silly old Shy Guys! I beat him up, didn't I, Mario? Good job, Watt. I guess that's supposed to be like a baby girl. Baby girl, what's your name? T-Pain? Where did that come from? It's Muscular, the Sailor Star. I like this dude. How did I do his voice before? I made him sound like Michelangelo from the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Oh no, you know what this means? It's time to bake a cake as Princess Peach. It's like everybody's least favorite thing. Because you gotta wait a perfect 30 seconds or else it all goes wrong. Thank goodness for smartphones that have a stopwatch. To save the fourth star spirit, muscular Mario and the disbanded the gang of shy guys. Slowly it seems as if the life force is returning to the once bleak night sky, but the stars won't truly shine until the star rod is rested from Bowser's evil grasp. Three more await. Only three? How did we get this far? This is it. This is like the official halfway point. So let's do some sneaking. What's up, dude? Hey, Charlie, those guards have stopped us again. Let's sneak out of here. We might be able to find some Mario stuff. I think it's a little safe to use that secret path. Bowser's probably figured it out by now. It's still all right. Bowser hasn't noticed anything. He looks scary, but he's basically a major bonehead. <laughs> nice. I think they finally start shorting it, shortening it, however. Like this hallway, I think it just automatically puts you through the bookcase thing. Yeah. Boom. Alright, what are we sneaking? That means there's probably a badge to find. I know we gotta go downstairs this time. We're gonna get some keys. So, this was the kitchen. Yes, it's time. Who are you? What's up, dude? Why, I'm Princess Peach, and who might you be? 
Oh, you're Princess Peach. Everyone calls me Gourmet Guy for some reason. I guess I'd better report to King Bowser. You aren't supposed to leave your room. But I am really hungry. Tell you what, you keep this a secret if you make something really yummy. Princess Peach, what do you say? Will you cook me something? I'd love to cook for you, but I have no ingredients and no utensils. Oh, that's no problem. There's a kitchen one floor below us. It's five star. You can go cook there. Here, you'll need this. This key will open the door now and get into that kitchen. Mm -hmm. All right. I'll just sit here and wait for my yummy meal. Oh, yeah, I forgot. There's plenty of guards, so be careful. All right, let's go bake a cake. Although we have free reign to wander a whole other section of Peach's Castle, which means we have to search for a badge. There's got to be one. I remember my first couple times playing this game. I didn't even utilize that purple treasure chest. And some of the best badges in the game are here in Peach's Castle. Like, Power Rush is huge. That, that badge is awesome. Oh, yeah, there's a toad hiding in the closet. Oh, and there is a chest. Is this a badge? What is this? Blast stand! When in danger, you receive half damage. That's just as good as uh, Power Rush. What's up, buddy? Oh, no, I'm caught for sure! Oh, Princess Peach, you're okay. Thank the stars. You're a toad from the castle. How long have you been hiding in here? Well, since Bowser took over, I was so scared of being caught that I jumped into this closet. I'm hiding in here until Mario comes and saves us all. Princess Peach, you ought to hide too. It's risky out there. Please don't take any chances. <laughs> ah, the toads. All right, I made my way back to this chest. In the last stand goes. And now back to the kitchen to actually do what we're supposed to do. I hope I don't mess this up. I gotta, I gotta get a moment to grab my phone for the, the stopwatch feature. Cause that counting to thirty, man. That's like the hardest thing in the world. Sometimes, especially when you don't know if the N64 can actually count to 30 appropriately or if it's in its own time zone. Because, you know, computer speed things, I don't understand stuff. Ramblings. Charlie, go find a cookbook. What shall we do first? Princess Peach, this looks like a good cookbook. Let's use it. How's it look? Anything yummy? Hang on a second. What about special strawberry cake? Sounds good, let's whip one up. Okay, read me the recipe, Charlie. Well, okay, listen first. Put sugar and eggs in a bowl. Go ahead, Princess Peach. All right, sugar and eggs. Egg, sugar. You picked up the sugar. And then you put it in the bowl. Oh, this is amazing. Egg. Egg. There we go, I did it. Done. Okay, on to the next one. Mix and whip the ingredients. Oh, we got a mash a like crazy. Get ready. All set. When I say start. For 10 seconds? I can't wait that long. It's so vicious. Look at her face. I mean, I, that is the mixing face. Duh. That's it, great job. Yeah, I'm not doing that again. Don't make me do it. You best knock it off. All right, next step. Now, flour and butter in the bowl. Okay, where's the flour? Is this it? That's it. You've got the flour. An ingredient for royal cakes. And then strawberry and cream and butter. There's the butter. What's this? Cleanser. Oh, that would make a great cake. I think that's how you erase and start over. Butter in the bowl. I did it. Done? Yes. After you've mixed the ingredients... Oh, I gotta do this again? No, I think it does it automatically. Wait, this is a perfect time to grab my thing. Okay, I got it. Not alarm clock. Stopwatch. There we go. I'm ready. On to the next step. Now, bake the batter in the oven for 30 seconds. You can't redo this step. I remember that clearly, because I had to redo this 800,000 times as a kid. Because it counts like 20 something put in the cake with a when does it start though that's the problem with this i never know when to start counting like when i press a all right here we go ready i think as soon as it closes there okay we're going this is ridiculous uh, i don't know i can't i can never do this without an actual stopwatch
Almost there. But like, I still don't know if this is right though. Like if I was to start the timer when the thing closes or as soon as I press A. There we go. That was like right on, it stopped exactly at 30. If that was the Majora's Mask bunny who had game with the postman, I would have won. We're gonna decorate it with cream and strawberries. But can I actually eat it though? Cause that's the thing, I get so excited about tasty and even this cake thing, but then you can't eat it. Cause if you lick the TV screen, you'll shock your tongue. And that's just not good. I could go for some chips and salsa too. That has nothing to do with cake. We did it, it looks great. Let's hope it works. If I get this on the first try, I will be so happy. It's like I graduated from Paper Mario school. And luckily you don't have to sneak around with the cake. Here you go. Oh, I've been waiting so long, I've wasted away to nothing. Well, if it made me count to 30. Thank you, heart. Come on, love it, love it. Yes, oh yeah. I'm just as happy as him, delicious. This is way too delicious. <laughs> this guy's awesome. I want a gourmet guy video game. That was really good. I haven't felt that way since well ever. Show my gratitude, I'll tell you a secret. Let me get a little closer. One of the star spears is on Mount Lava Lava on Lava Lava Island. Is that like Gola Gola Island? There's a nasty piranha. Hmm. Does it play the same awesome piranha boss music from Yoshi's Island? Because that music is awesome. Ricocheting the eggs against the wall to hit the little band-aid part. I haven't played that game in forever. Did you hear that? We're going to Gola Gola Island and we're going to sing a song and put our foot in our hand or however the lyrics go. <laughs> Boom, boom. Yeah, go spread the news there, Charlie. Tell our guests what they've won. What's with all the short shouting? Keep it quiet in there. Oh, it's you. I thought it was one of the guards yelling. So, it was you, Princess Peach. You've got to keep it down. You're a prisoner, and as a prisoner, you need to keep... What? What are you doing out of your room, anyway? Guards, get the princess. Here we go again. Oh, sorry, Princess Peach. There we go, and now it's time to see Muscular, the star. Phew, ah, oh, fresh air! After being cooped up in there for so long, I could really use some outdoor exercise. My name's Muscular Mario, I must thank you for saving me. Now it's my turn to help you. Behold! Power up, baby. Mario's star energy goes up to four. You can use Chill Out, a new star spirit power. Attack power of enemies goes down. Call on me when you find yourself in need. I'll always come quickly to aid you in battle. Now I'm going back to my Giro Star Haven. Mario! Mario, Mario, I have news. News from the castle. <laughs> Honorable Star Spirit. Hi. Hmm. I believe you're Charlie, no? You're the youngster who recently ascended from Starborn Valley up to Star Haven. What? You remember my name? Oh, uh, why, of course, we're like family. I'm so touched. Don't make such a false lad. I'm sure you'll go on and do great things. I must take my leave now. Goodbye, Mario. And Charlie, of course. See you later, dude. I don't think I ever use your power ever. I talked with Muscular, the Honorable Star Spirit. I rarely even have a chance. I'm, uh, in Star Haven, I'm shaking. Oops, I'm sorry. I have important news from the castle. According to the information Princess Peach and I got, you have to go to Gola Gola Island. And put your foot in your hand. <laughs> what a dumb show. Uh. Alright, well we're back now. How do we start chapter 5? I know how to get there. You gotta ride a whale. But the question is... Is it just there? I mean, we're right here. We might as well check. But isn't there like a whole to-do with... Uh, the Koopa Professor, what's his name again? Colorado, there you go. Oh, speaking of, he's right here. Is it, what do we have to do though? Was that my old dear chap? Um, no, 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 we already met you, why are you telling me? What are you doing here? Well, I for one am traveling to a lava lava island in the southern sea to solve a diabolical mystery. It would seem that there are ancient treasures waiting in a volcanic cave. I'm in a bit of a fix though, no way to get here, you see. Think now, Colorado, how to cross the sea. Well, there's supposed to be a giant whale. 
Oh, there is. That's right. You got to butt stomp him. That, wow. Okay, we could start chapter five already. I thought there was like some weird thing. I don't really have many items. Hmm. We might need to do some preparation. But let's let's see. What are you doing? I know there's a little battle here, but it's not too hard if I remember correctly. And I recall, I think, we both kind of liked it. Oh, good heavens, I was wondering where this was. It seems to be a huge tuna. I'm not a tuna, I'm a whale. And I have a problem. It feels like something's jumping around in my belly. Help me. I say, old boy, this great tuna seems to have a bit of a belly ache. Well, say you learned the fish a hand, hmm? I told you I'm not a tuna. I'm not even a fish. And I have a headache from your jumping around on me, too. Do you think you could check my belly? I'm begging you, please. All right, well, let's do it, I think. No, I was just goofing around on the stupid badge menu. And I didn't even change anything. Who dat? What do you think you're doing? I don't know what I'm doing. Let me look at my badges. I'm all kinds of confused right now. I feel incomplete. I'm not prepared. I did not go to the bathroom before we left. And I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, quick hammers. Nice. I spy with my little eye somebody who has no idea what he's doing, but I got refund back. Ice power? Although... No. There's no need for that right now. Spike shield would be more important. Ice power comes later. Wait, what? Get back here. You just walk into him, right? What is the deal here? There we go. Hey, fella, you want a piece of this? You got it, I'm wondering as all get out. Prepare for some pain. All right, little buddy, what are you and what what is your point in existing? Let me stomp on you. Or we could really stomp on you. Press A as the thing lights up. Got it. Boom, boom, boom. That's a cool noise. Now I'm gonna, really gonna stomp on this dude. Watch out. Eight damage, look at that. Oh. Okay. Now we know. Oh yeah, that's right. He hangs from there. And now I can't do anything. Apparently Quick Hammer works though. Too bad I don't have an egg missile anymore. Maybe we just gotta hit him and then he'll be down. Get down here, boy. Nah, he goes right back up. Uh, sure. What else am I gonna do? Oh! Seeing a lot of you around here. Are you still alive? You're still alive. Seven damage, and he's done. Beautiful. And that's only with one power plus badge. We gotta figure out how to stack them. Shucks. First I think I get away from whatever, and then I get all swallowed up by some huge fish, and then this fellow with the mustache goes upside my head. <laughs> I've just been falling out of frying pans and into fire since I was just a grub. Talk about a lousy lot in life. Mario, it's me, you know, the whale. Can you hear me? That stomach ache seems to have cleared right up. I feel fantastic. I wonder how they recorded that one. Whoosh. And now we have access to the Yoshi village. You plum idiot! You know, I thought I was a goner for sure. I'm awfully sorry, I was just having a nap with my mouth open. I suppose I can see my way to forgiving you this time, but you just watch it. I reckon I owe you some thanks after all, Mr. Mustache. Y'all take care now. Bye, weirdo thing. That's not nice. I feel so much better. They should call you Dr. Mario. There must be some way I can express my gratitude. I've got it. I, the tuna, am, I mean, I, the whale, am quite good at swimming. To express my thanks, I'll go anywhere you want. Pardon the eavesdropping, but did you say anywhere? Mario, the old tuna tamer, accompany me to the shores of Lava Lava Island. What a trip it'll be. The island will be wonderful. You must trust my instincts. All right, peppy hair. Yes, we know that that's where we have to go next. There's a big volcano on the island, and it's on the verge of erupting. Very dangerous. You still want to go? Well, okay, then. It's your call. Just let me know when you're ready. Yeah, about that. I need to go fix some stuff. Boom! I have room for the super shroom. We got it. Nice. And I also, first of all, want to heal. But over here is that shooting star that I passed up before fighting General Guy. So, we have space in my inventory now, thanks to some checking of items. 
And I would greatly like to have this going into Chapter 5. Because I seem to remember lots of instances of four or five enemies on screen. Alright, that's enough of the song. Okay, one last thing. I think I'm all situated, but I'm gonna buy two Thunder Rages. Okay, I think we're finally good. I spent 800 years on this badge menu. I took away Zap Tap for now, and I have two Power Plus badges active. So I think we're ready to finally go to Chapter 5, although we're already getting up there on time. So, it's a weird... I had a good system going of, like, beating a chapter and then starting a video with Peach. But this one is... everything got kind of messed up. Because I didn't fight General Guy in time. What a peaceful thing. I guess. But this chapter's kind of neat. I like all the... it's a Yoshi village and it plays the Yoshi's Island map screen music, or the title screen. Chapter 5, Hot Hot Times on Lava Lava Island. There's that infamous piranha. But yeah, a lot of the en enemy encounters lots of poisonous piranhas and really annoying fuzzies that... I forget what they do, but this particular breed of fuzzy in this chapter is annoying. But we could go back to Toad Town whenever. Yes, well, finally made it, eh? So this is a lot smashing! Gracious, behold Mario! Off in the distance, the top of Mount Lava Lava. Triumphant, we must hurry! Simmer down, buddy. But over here is a, uh, a stopwatch. Paralyzes all enemies. Later on, there's a star spirit that does that same thing. With, I think, a greater chance. There's also coconuts in the tree. Oh, yeah. he's He gets himself into trouble every two seconds in this thing. But we'll probably just make it to the village. Oh. And to the save block and then start over next time. Igor and Boo's shop. I gotta do the, all the mailing stuff. All right, these are the fuzzies I'm talking about. You're supposed to attack the other guy, old bean. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, so hopefully with the double power plus and Quake Hammer, followed up by Cooper, I should be able to make quick work of these guys. Okay, that only did four, even with two power pluses. We do get a hammer upgrade this chapter. Good, that was was enough at least. That's what I like to see. I forget what it is about these guys that I don't like. Phew, you saved me. Many thanks, old chum. Well, enough of that. Let's pull ourselves together and press on. What say? Is there a coconut in this tree? Indeed there is. You can throw it to damage an enemy for pretty much garbage damage, but it can also be cooked. I think you can make a cocoa pop. If you can how do you use this flower again? Oh, you press Z. That would make sense. The spinning thing. Get me out of here. I don't... <laughs> uh, I'm having all this trouble and the time is getting up there. Um, this looks suspicious. But yeah, cake mix and a coconut I think makes a cocoa pop, but I forget what it does. I think it comes with a status ailment thing. Some recipes are weird like that. But there's Yoshis. Yoshis with feathers in their heads. Like this guy. Look at this dude. <laughs> Just... The most relaxed expression ever. You wish to come to help melt lava lava, do you? Mm, the entrance to the volcano in the jungle, but it's very difficult to get to it. The volcano has awakened as well. I think it may be too dangerous for you to go there. Well, what good are you? You're supposed to help me out. Will you listen to that music? Super Nintendo all over again. And there's baby Yoshis. There's all kinds of good stuff. But we're getting way up there on time, so let's see the shop. They've got cheaper Thunder Rages. Anyway, let's check that coconut, because that's just an ingredient. And anything else? Now, the rest I think I'm going to roll with. The stopwatch isn't really that great, but... Alright, so we'll rest up in the inn and save at this block, and I think that'll be an episode right there. And next time, we will pick up and really start Chapter 5 and see what's going on with all these Yoshis. So thanks for watching, you guys. Hope you're enjoying it, and this bed looks fantastic. See you next time.